Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On this day, October 14th in 1817, Manuel Garcia de Tejada willed $1,500 to the Roman Catholic congregation if they organized within two years. Manuel Garcia was the first of the Tejadas to immigrate to America from Castile, Spain, settling in Natchez, Mississippi, and serving under Bernardo de Galvez. He and his wife, Mahala Travion of Tennessee, would have two children, John Augustin and Joseph Garcia. By 1782, Tejada was serving as a superintendent of the Natchez Royal Hospital and was a recipient of a Natchez land grant along the North Fork of Coles Creek in present-day Jefferson County. Tejada became a prominent lawyer, planter, and tavern keeper who, by the time of his death in 1817, had bought and sold several plantations and had accumulated a considerable estate. In 1798, he acquired and expanded an early building in the city in which his tenants ran a variety of businesses, including the American Eagle Tavern. Tejada, as the building is known today, is believed to be the first brick building constructed in Natchez and is one of the oldest existing structures in the town. In 1817, Edward Turner, State Attorney General, Speaker of the State House of Representatives, and Chief Justice of the State Supreme Court purchased the house after Tejada's death. In 1964, Dr. and Mrs. George Moss purchased the brick dwelling and embarked on an eight-year restoration project of the building, once described as a large, elegant, commodious brick house. Hi, I'm Hannah Smith Mason, and my grandparents, Dr. Moss and Margaret Moss, restored Tejada in the 1960s. My parents, Helen and Randy Smith, live there now. And this has been your Natchez History Minute.